You may have seen that you can buy home designs online. These are my notes on online plans. Plan services have been around since the late 1800s. They were popularized around the turn of the century with home packages from companies like Sears and Aladdin Homes. In the 1960s, Home Planners Incorporated became one of the largest suppliers of home plan books. These old plan books can actually be helpful when you're renovating a historic home to help understand what was in style and the trends of that time. The introduction of the internet, however, has made these online plans almost a staple to anyone's new home search. So let's talk about the benefits and drawbacks of these home design services. Initially, online plans might look like an economical route to home design. This works great. If you've found an online design that works, if you've, this works great if you've found an online design that works for your family. But there's a lot more to a custom home than just a set of prints. Maybe you've found a set of online plans that's close, but just needs a few tweaks or adjustments. It's tempting at this point to call a local architect and see if they can just redraw the plans and redraw the prints for you. We actually get this call quite a bit. Unfortunately, it's not that simple. Online designs are copyrighted by the owner. Redrawing them, even with minor changes, infringes on their copyright and can result in ugly litigation and substantial additional cost. The good news is most plan services are willing to make modifications to their designs. This is far more economical than purchasing the licensed drawings to have a local architect modify them. Another tip before buying a set of online plans, get an example set of their drawings. This will help you understand if there's enough technical information to actually build the design. Speaking of technical information, it's also wise to look at where the designer is based out of. A lot of the online plan services are actually in California or Florida. While the design might look great, you need to consider local construction methods. The methods we use in Michigan are completely different than what is done in Florida. When was the last time you saw it snow in Florida? This is another reason to get a set of example plans before spending money on your dream home. So you found your dream design online, the example plans look good, you don't need any tweaks. So now what? It's likely you're still going to have to hire a local engineer to review the drawings. Most plan companies don't hold any liability to the accuracy of their drawings for your local conditions, which means you're going to have to hire an engineer or an architect to review the drawings for all the rules and regulations that you have, as well as making sure that the roof will hold up in the next snowstorm. So remember when I said that online plans can seem economical? These are the kind of surprise costs that you need to consider before purchasing the plans. Here's another cost you need to consider. A lot of the online plan sources will have a quote unquote construction cost for that model. These are based on local factors and things that they have found in their experience but aren't adjusted for your location and your building materials. So you really need to work with someone locally to help you get a true cost for your project. And another thing to consider is who's reading your drawings during construction. While most builders are capable of resolving issues that they might find in the drawings, there are times that having an architect on site will help to make sure that the design you want is the design you get. While there are many great online plan services, one of which might even work for you, it's not always quite that simple. So if you're looking for a truly custom home for your family, you might want to consider contacting a local architect. Or you could consider hiring this designer. It's really up to you. This is just scratching the surface when it comes to online plans. While there can be benefits to using these stock plans, there's also a lot that you need to consider before making this initial investment into the design of your home. And these are my design notes.